This is a review of the PowerSmart DB7006 Snow Thrower. I am Steven Wimberly, and this is Working with Wimberly. What's going on, everybody? This is a quick review of the PowerSmart DB7006 Snow Thrower that they sell at Home Depot. I did a video showing you guys how to put this thing together, and I got a lot of requests for a review, so here it is. I finally used this thing to get the snow out of my driveway and backyard. And this has really poor reviews on homedepot.com and I know exactly why. So here's the issue. Looking at it from the front, I'm gonna pull it back. And what we have here is a metal plate going along the bottom. And and this metal plate is held in with three Phillips head screws. There's one here, one here in the middle, and then one here on this side. So this metal plate right here, as you can see, it's all scraped up and the black paint is off of it. When this thing is on and you're trying to push this through the snow, or when it's on and you're trying to push this on the ground, it will not move. It just digs into the ground and you cannot push it forward. I tried to go down one time and come back and I barely made it. So I brought it back here and decided I would just remove this steel plate and see if it would work any better. So I'm just gonna take the three screws out. So after pulling out the three screws, the metal plate comes off after taking out the three screws and taking off the metal plate, this thing basically pulled me down the driveway. And at that point, it did fairly well. So the only way I could get this thing to work and not just dig into the ground and actually go forward is to remove that plate. Once you do that, it works fine. I didn't have any issue with it. Now the problem is, and if I keep using it like this, there's a good chance I'm gonna wear away the plastic at the bottom of the snow blower. So I might end up having to put something else along the bottom that will actually allow it to slide. But for right now to get this thing to work, I had to take this plate off. I'm not gonna bother taking this thing back to Home Depot. It's filled up with oil, it's filled up with gasoline. I'm just gonna keep the plate off and roll with it. If you have not purchased this yet and you're thinking about it, it might be a good idea to get a different brand or a different snowblower that you don't have to modify in order for it to work. But as I stated before, I'm just gonna go ahead and keep it. I'm gonna keep the metal plate off and just use it like that. If you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe to the channel, give me a thumbs up, and leave a comment. God bless you all.